Hello, my name is Emma. I am a spiritual teacher, entrepreneur, a lot of different hats. I have a lot of different hats. Sharing with you spiritual thoughts on money, finances, prosperity, and wealth. Wealth is created by ideas coming to fruition. So to be able to access a flow of creative genius that brings you the insights and the intuitive guidance to show up at the right place at the right time, meet the right people, come into the right opportunities, and make opportunities happen for yourself will require that you switch out of beta consciousness, which is the analytical reasoning mind, and get into your creative flow of genius, which is your alpha brainwave state. And this is the state that you are in when you're in the shower or you're on cruise control, you're taking a walk and all of a sudden you have this amazing flow of ideas. Being able to cultivate this state of consciousness goes against the mainstream ideas of productivity and success. So you're going to have to really deprogram to reprogram your brain. As the spiritual teacher Baba Ramdas says, the analytical mind is a beautiful instrument and a lousy master. So you really have to learn how to switch off of the analytical reasoning state of mind and get into your creative flow of genius and allow something greater to come through you, to pour through you and into the work that you do. You can't just try to look into manifesting, marketing, how do I create content that converts, how do I write copy that converts? How do I perfect the sales landing page? You really have to give it all to the flow of creative genius, to the universal mind, to bring your awareness to the level at which those insights will come through for you. Five fifty-five p.m. Hello, angel number, and hello, beautiful soul. It is so wonderful to connect with you today. I am going to share some thoughts with you that I had while washing the dishes. Of course, when you focus mindfully on what you're doing, your brainwave state starts to slow down, and you start to have lower frequency, higher amplitude brainwaves. So lower frequency means less mental activity and higher amplitude means there's more space between the waves. So the waves are looser. When the waves are looser, you start to open up your intuition, your creativity, your genius. Letting go of the limits of the conditioned mind and opening up to the expanse of greater possibility which challenges all of our deep social and evolutionary conditioning. Ripping free of this can be quite nasty work and this is what I help with as a spiritual coach. This is how limitless wealth is created. The infinite creative power of the universal mind lives within you. All barriers are removed. When you start plugging into a greater power that far exceeds your own, you will start to see things happen that you cannot explain, that you could not have planned or made happen on your own in ways that defy odds and expectations. This will further reinforce and solidify your awareness and reliance on the spiritual dimension to take precedence over the material. So there are these times when it's just like, bam, it's on. The inspiration is just streaming through you. You are just running on pure creative genius and whatever it is that you put out there, the sheer force of your brilliance, your personal power channels through whatever medium it is, whether it's painting, creating art, podcasting, whatever it might be. And this is exactly what unlocks the channels, the flow of wealth to you because avenues that weren't there are created. And the prosperity, the means, the resources, the connections are able to find their way through you through those avenues that you have created. There's something that is called the Einstellung effect, which is a very fancy neuroscience term, but it simply means that the mind only knows what it knows. It has its limits. It cannot compute or fathom absolutely everything in the entire universe. 
the set of possibilities that it has access to is dependent on past experiences, memories, learnings, and whatever conditioning you have. But if you really desire to go beyond all of that, you need to plug into universal consciousness. It's almost like plugging your computer into the wall using your power charger while you're binge watching a TV show, for example, you know that the battery is going to keep on going and it's not going to die out. I'm just using this analogy for you to wrap your mind around. Your minds can't just run and compute and do everything on its own. It has its limits, but unlimited perception opens up unlimited possibilities. So if he really wants to plug into unlimited perception and therefore unlimited possibilities, the only way is by connecting your energy to the energy of all that is and to recognize your oneness with all of it, to recognize your place in this universe. And then you will start to experience deeper meaning, purpose, fulfillment, prosperity, success, happiness, well-being in your life. And this will have profound, far-reaching changes in all aspects, all affairs of your life, your relationships, your finances, your creativity, which is richly rewarding and fulfilling to step into your genius and to truly express your authentic self. That is very powerful. And when you step into your genius and express your authentic, powerful self, you begin to radiate a magnetic field, a literally like your electromagnetic field of energy expands out like crazy when you do this and you start to magnetize and attract opportunities, resources, relationships, all forms of prosperity into your life automatically. And not only this, but healing also starts to happen automatically. Corrections of errors in perception that produce undesirable results in your reality begin to happen automatically and effectively. So if you wish to learn more from me and receive more of my transformative guidance to completely change your consciousness, the link is in the description details. Thank you so much for being such a part of a wonderful global community of compassionate, brilliant human beings that are rippling out so much love, light, and higher truth in this world. I really appreciate you. You are a part of the healing force of this entire world of the universe, and that is amazing. You are brilliant. You are a gift of source. Have a wonderful, beautiful, blessed day. I am wishing you infinite blessings. Bye, everyone.